<coughs> hey fellow agents, this is Agent Smith and we're going to be playing Freddy Farkas Frontier Performances. I believe we're on the 7th episode of this one. We'll go ahead and take a look around. So we got our guns back. Let's take a look at that actually real quick. Finally have our, our, our weapons from before. Your old pistols looking somewhat tarnished after so many years in storage are probably still quite serviceable. See, we're probably going to need ourselves some bullets or something, too. You cock the hammers, twirl the pistols, fake a shot, and slowly let the hammers back up. Yeah, that feels good. Damn good. Okay. Let's go ahead and see. I think the claim ticket goes to O'Hanahan's Barbershop. I believe that's the purpose of it, so we'll head in here. The claim ticket should get us our shoes back, if that makes sense. Uh, hello. Hey, I put out a fire last night and, and saved the town. Proud of me? Of course I'm proud of you. Why is Ahanahan having an Italian accent? Hey, Fletcher, how's the plumbing business? He doesn't respond. Apparently he's too engrossed in reading the latest copy of the Scoocher Down and Examiner. <laughs> Scoocher Down and Examiner. Hey, I put out a fire last night and, and saved the... Uh, go yeah, he doesn't care. Either way, well, let me give him this claim check here. Score. Give him my boots. Do you still have that pair of boots I dropped off for a shine? I know it's been about six years now, but I just remembered I left them here. Hmm, let me see. What's the number on this claim check? Hmm, let me look under the counter here. Yep, still here. Have them ready for you next Tuesday. Oh, never mind. I'll just take them as is. Uh, don't worry about the storage charges, okay? But the guy had, like, the inability to do a proper accent and just jumps around with it. Oh, these passenger pigeon skin boots bring back memories of the days before <laughs> Kenny the Kid gave you an ear job. Oh. You reach inside your old boots and find the ring remains of a pair of nasty old odor beaters. Ah, oh, okay. Well, good. I thought find something interesting in there. There's always kind of crazy stuff in this game. All right, let's go talk to the sheriff and see if, uh, if I could possibly, uh, get some assistance with this gun. Even though they're billing us to us, we'll never know. Sheriff, I'm going to be saying my goodbyes soon, and I just wanted to thank you for all your help. Don't mention it, boy. If I can do anything to make your departure more hasty or pleasant, feel free to ask. Well. Sheriff, I'm going to be saying my... Don't... Oh, oh. Let me see if I can show him my guns. So they don't shoot him. Now, you just hold on a cotton pick a minute. You mean to tell me that you, some kind of western hero, is just gonna walk in and shoot the sheriff in cold blood? No, no fair fight, no shootout in the middle of the street or nothing? No. Does that sound like an act of a hero, or does it sound like the act of a coward? Oh, uh, well, I coward, wasn't... I guess. I'm gonna try to do that, you though. You bet your boots. Let's just pretend this whole thing didn't happen. Shall we? Let's just see if you can get through this whole thing without shooting anyone outright. Okay? Okay. <laughs> Alright. Oh, jeez. That's an old trunk dated back to the 1870s. Actually, in that case, it's pretty new. Can I... Ooh. Mike's stinky. Pink ink. Our house tipping. I have none of that. Alright. Can I get a different conversation if I come back in here? I want to see if he could help me out with weaponry or anything like that. If that don't work, I'm going to have to go check the other one. Sheriff, I'm going to... Hmm. Okay. We'll go ahead and take a look and talk to the mercantile, see if there's anything extra I can talk to him about. If not, we're going to start walking around town and doing some exploring. 
going to mom's get some coffee. The do hey, Willie! Leave me alone. I'm crabby. So what else is new? Listen, I'm gonna be leaving town for a while. Yeah, right. <laughs> no, I am. For real. I'm out of here. You are not. You're gonna practice your gun slinging, then you're gonna dredge up that mucky old past of yours and go back to being a big shot hero. How do you know? No idea what you're talking about. Hey, half the Western heroes in America done the same thing. Good luck to you. See you in the dime novels. Now get a move on. <laughs> you know what? Actually, he's damn straight. I'm gonna go out to that place. I'm gonna set these uh, bottles I got up on a fence. I'm gonna go shoot some shit. I don't know if this is the one I wanted, but if oh, close, that was close. This fence over here looks like a perfect location. It feels like it's the type of place that they put together simply for me to do this. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these bottles up on the fence. I'm gonna go shoot some shit. <clears throat> I found out why I was walking so fast in the last episode. There's no of the point end. in setting up target practice until you're ready to start shooting. Well, how am I not ready to start shooting? Hop Sing, how'd you put up those no pest strips yet? <laughs> Sorry, Mom. They're on order. Get ourselves some coffee. Mom offers free coffee to her regular customers. You're as regular as anyone. 11 a.m. every morning, you head straight for the outhouse. So, as usual, you pour yourself a steaming hot <laughs> cup of joe. <laughs> regular as in going to the bathroom regularly. <laughs> hmm. There's nothing like a steaming hot cup of joe from Mom's Cafe. Brewed from mountain-grown beans from the steep-sloped hills of Jamaica. Much better than them shoddy trench-grown coffee beans from the shallow slope ditches of Peoria. Yeah. Ugh. You know, she's got that, that old horse manure problem. Who would steal a handful of clay from a gravesite? This guy. Let's take this and dump this out and see if that messes with her any. At least keep That's her... what you've done! Freddy Focus, I'll see you run out of town for this! Hop sing, hop to it. Get out here and clean up this mess. Damn these flies. <laughs> oh, yes, yes. Oh, 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 you're in big water now. So. Pre previously, on a previous episode, I had gotten to the back of this place and had found a pie on the windowsill, but I couldn't get it because Hop Sing was there. That must be how I gotta get to it, so I don't know what I'm gonna use it for, but I can access it now, so we might as well go ahead and do that. Get around back and grab that. Yes, he's... Oh, he's not there. Score. Good pie. move, Freddy. Drop in one steaming hot pie to get another. Hello? That was weird. Loaded for no reason. Oof, we. Now let's go give the sheriff a nice hot pie and a nice hot uh, coffee. Maybe all of this mixed together might be enough to get him to get to move on. And go take a look through his stuff and see if we can get some bullets. Apparently that's what I'm missing. Mmm, pie. Oh, there's nothing quite like mom's apple pie. Now, someone would just invent baseball. Voila, instant Americana. <laughs> you squish the pie a bit to see what oozes out. You sincerely hope them's apples. <laughs> All right. Yeah, like I said, I'm going over to see the sheriff again. 
see if I can convince him to uh, help me out here and hopefully get a different conversation with him. This game is kind of weird like that. Like, uh, some of the stuff doesn't seem straightforward logical to you on these. But that is most of these kind of Sierra games. A lot of weird stuff you gotta do, and sometimes it makes sense to do. How about some coffee, Sheriff? Maybe that gets you off your butt. Since it makes you regular. Score. Say, Sheriff, I know how much a law enforcement person like yourself enjoys a good hot cup of coffee every now and then. Thanks, partner. But you know what? Something sweet would sure taste good right now. That was what the pie for. I bet that's true. I'll be glad to try and find you something to munch on. But in the meantime, I've been thinking about moving to another city. But I've got no bullets. I was wondering if you yes. have any bullets that would fit an old 45. Whatever, get me the hell out of here, right? Why so sure, he's son, here. Have a box of these Remington. No charge. They're on the county. <laughs> Alright, let's give him that pie then. Since he's looking for something sweet. Piss in it for him. Score! Here you go, Sheriff Shift. I found some of Mom's nice hot apple pie for you. I know how much a law enforcing person like yourself enjoys sweet fatty breakfasts. Well, thank you. I've been so hungry, I could have had a bar. This will sure go could've good with that bar. cup of coffee you brung me earlier. Uh, Sheriff, do you have anything I could use to clean these old guns of mine before I leave town? They're mighty dirty, and I want to be prepared for my long journey. I knew he'd have what I want. A stupid way to get around to it. Okay, son. But this gun cleaning kit will be the last thing I get. Now. Get your guns clean, get your horse packed, and get your ass out of my town. He's why such an ass about it now. Was it because I tried to shoot you? I didn't have any bullets anyway. It's not like I would have done anything. All right, now do I have everything I need to get this done? Sweet Lord. I want to be able to actually put together all of my stuff. Or... You slip the bullets in the chamber as the old memories come rushing back. And a few featuring you and your first cousin out behind the barn when you were both curious eight-year-olds. No one need to know about that. <laughs> Assuming that's a cleaning kit. After removing the bullets, you clean and polish your pistols till they shine like a coarse gold kid with his first passing grade. Good thing you removed all that rust from your barrel. A damn thing could have exploded right in your face. When you're done, you replace the bullets in the chamber. <laughs> I'm glad they had enough sense for that, because that would have been stupid. All right, now, with everything together, we should be able to get over to this freaking... Um, Noah's defense area. <laughs> and there's another one. Get. <laughs> Always a fight. And set up... Oh, that's not what I wanted. And set up these uh, bottles and do some shooting. Oh, hey, Hopsing. I guess I am supposed to be here now. What you doing, buddy? Well, Strainy, I think I'm ready to Hopsing, try some Strainy, target shooting. You ready? Uh, certainly. I am without a desire to wait any further to stand in front of your blazing guns and take my life in your hands to help you perfect your shooting. How do you want to start? Perhaps it would be besting if you place some targets up on the fence post for a commencement. That would probably make sense. Which I have some. It's interesting that he's out here now. I knew that would be the general idea of this. Alright. <clears throat> so. <clears throat> Do your worst. I'm feeling pretty tough, but don't uh, bust my chops. I had too much tequila last night. Go easy. I go easy. First, we no medium difficulty. You can successfully strike the bottles from afar with the bullets of your pistol. Then I will toss the bottles up in the air, and you may try to hit them in flight. Good luck, and may the best man win. I hope I got the skill for that. Ooh, mouse. Oh, it's shaky. Jeez. 
Jeez. That took a second. Can I? They go so fast. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna keep firing at these things until they say they're done. If I have to hit moving targets for any point in this game, I'm gonna be out of luck. There we go. Getting better. Yes. That took a minute. Very good, Freddy Holy Parker. crap. Let us try some quick drawing. Just make sure you hit the target and not me. So I gotta be quick as I can. It's gonna bring it back down for me every time. I'm uploading myself inside. Now for the big challenge. Six bottles all at once. Hmm. Oh, I got it. Okay, that was automatic. Thank goodness. Say, Freddy Farkas, you are not so bad after all at this shooting gig. Oh, yeah. Why, thanks, Srini. My life and the lives of every man, woman, and ruminant in this town depend on my being quick with a gun. Did you not mention earlier that your life is in danger most forthcoming? Yeah. Something like that. Might I then suggest that you might be excellent to placing a disguise upon your person? It's not a bad idea. It to appearances that Freddy Farkas has no longer around in this locality. Good thinking, Srini. I'll need a disguise of some sort, something that will strike terror into the hearts of the bad guys. I know, a bat. I'll disguise myself as a yes. bat. Yes. And you can the... be Srini, the boy wonder. Yes, exactly. You have any leotards? A Batman and a, and, a, and a Robin. Pardon me for asserting, but this bat thing is really hokey. Ah, you're right. Too juvenile. Let's yes. see. Mm. How about... Might I suggest a skin-tight costume with flowing cape and placed upon the manly chest thereof a large F for Farkas? Yes, that's a good idea too. Nah, that'd never work. I don't want people to know I'm Freddy, remember? Then perhaps you are needing to do something about that right ear. Or rather, the lack of that right ear. Ooh, that's a good idea. Dang it, you're right. Everyone knows me as the one-eared pharmacist. I need to make a new one somehow. Maybe forge one out of metal yeah, or something. No, no, no. I've got I'll wax. Give it some thought and I got and a meet you back guy. at the pharmacy once I've completed my disguise. Yes. All right. Well, I'm going to go ahead and end this one here. We're going to work on getting that set up. Uh, the next one we'll work on a disguise. I think I know what I got to do. I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to go get a wax ear made uh, by the whittling guy in the um, in the. Uh, convenience store so that'll be what we'll do in the next one but hope you guys have been enjoying these and if you are give it a thumbs up don't forget to comment and subscribe and hit that notification bell and other than that i'll see y'all in the next one have a great day hey fellow asians don't forget to like and subscribe by clicking the button in the center of the screen you can also find the last video by clicking the button to the left and you can take a look at some of the other stuff i've done by clicking the button to the right hope you enjoyed the video have a good day.